Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to mix up a little tonic that will keep the pests away from your lawn, your garden, your flowers, any of that, any of your vegetation. Now by pests I mean like bugs, insects, all kinds of stuff like that. I'm not talking varmints here, although this might help a little bit with varmints. This is mainly for bugs, so great for different like moths, spiders, aphids, uh, little beetles, any of those things you do not want in your plants. So to start out, we've got our hose end sprayer, 20 gallon hose end sprayer as typical. Then this is a really, really simple recipe. It is one cup of tobacco tea. Now, if you need to know how to make the tobacco tea, check out the video in the card up above here because that is going to show you exactly what to do. It's really very simple. It's some tobacco and some hot water put it together and you have tobacco tea. And it is a cup of Murphy's oil soap, which is excellent. So these two things combined will repel bugs. So we've got a cup of each and here we go. We're gonna give this a little shake up to make sure it's all good. And liquid measure versus dry measure. It's really with this type of a thing, we're not baking something, no souffles here, so it doesn't matter too much. Just get it close. And we were a little under a cup, so I'm going to just top it off a little bit right there. All right, so that is our tobacco tea. Then we have one cup of Murphy's oil. Now this stuff, very good here. It's a little thick, so we'll pour that right in. Whoop. And there we go. So pour that in there. And that is it. Now, from here, you have a couple different options. You can top this off with water to then spray that all over your vegetation to keep the bugs away. Or you can leave it just like this and use this amount to spray. Either way will work just fine. Obviously, if you top it off with water, you're gonna cover a more area and it's gonna be a little bit more diluted. If you don't top it off with water, it'll be less area and a little less diluted. I would recommend, depending on your bug problem or how big of an area, you do what works best for your area and for your needs. If you've got a big bug problem, probably don't wanna dilute it. If you're just doing this as a preventative measure, I'd fill this sucker up with water, spray it all over. If you start noticing some bugs, do it again. So that is that. All we need to do now is seal this up and then hook up our hose right here, pull the lever and spray away. So I'm gonna show you a little video of what it looks like spraying right now. All right, so here we are. I've got the tonic right here of Murphy's oil and tobacco tea and I've got this nice apple tree that I don't want any pests on. So I'm gonna just kind of give it a little spray. No big deal. Just kind of spray it down and that is it. Now obviously, if you want to spray down multiple areas, you can do that. You can do multiple trees. So I've got another one here that will just kind of spray down right there. And we give that a good spray. More the merrier, but it doesn't matter. You can spray to the point of runoff or you can spray it a little bit depending on your pest control needs. So that is it. That is how to mix up a tonic to keep away bugs, beetles, and other little pests that might be wreaking havoc on your plants.